Oh, oh shit. Maybe a red one is one that doesn't break. Because, man. Who built these crates? They really can't take anything. Let's play Horror Tales The Wine. Hello and welcome to Hula New Place Short in Your Horror Games. I dusted up my environment with this little, you know, gimmick. Um, <laughs> and today I'm going to play um, a limited time prologue of a horror game series, I think. And it, it looks so cool. So the developers, uh, Carlos Damegav is um, the developer on Itch. I think it's a whole team though. I'm not quite sure though. Um, what they're doing is they want to create a horror series, but every single episode is kind of a different experience. And definitely from the settings, they have Mediterranean, Mediterranean, isn't it Mediterranean horror? Mediterranean horror? I'm not quite sure. Anyways, it's um, there's something with like uh, polar caps and ice and and whatnot. So they, I think they really want to try to create horror experience that are vastly different from each other, but probably then make sense within, you know, the whole series. So I'm really looking forward to this uh, limited time prologue and uh, yeah, see what it can do. Alrighty. Sorry, I, th I slightly cut off the beginning of the developer. <laughs> Language, yes. New game. A pandemic which causes strong fevers, terrible delirium, and death has relentlessly decimated the inhabitants of the archipelago. Rumor has it that a prestigious red wine produced in the capital can cure the sick. Oop. You are Marty Vermello. In a desperate attempt to cure the infection of your loved ones, you steal a boat and head to the winery where the red wine is made somewhere in the capital. If you find just one unopened bottle of red wine, it will be enough. On reaching the island, so no m wine mom there. <laughs> eh. On reaching the island, you decide to go to the winery owner's estate to try your luck there. The Bandy de Bosque family estate is closed and has a dog. No, Benita Bosque. That's the name. Wow. A cold smell of death, calm, and silence comes over your body when you arrive at the dock. They sealed off the infected families in their own homes without food or water, but even the, then the quarantine didn't work. There's no one left alive. Hits differently now that we're in the middle of an actual pandemic, right? So it seems. Ooh. Well, I mean, I already know that I'm not the only one. The capital's economy was very dependent on the exportation of Benny de Bosque wine. Oh my god. I think I've seen this in... I, I, I think I've seen a Let's Play. But it's been a while, so I forgot pretty much everything. Can I sail home? You cannot sail home now. Find a bottle of red wine. <laughs> Find a bottle of red wine first. It was worth a try, okay? Because it, it sounds really creepy to be here. But it looks gorgeous. Look at this. Ooh, creepy statue. Look at this. Wow. Move mouse. Yeah, I, I'm, already, I'm already doing it. That's not good. Oh. Well, it's probably... That would be the dream. Oh. Bleep. Bunny the boss. Broken bottle of red wine. So is it like blood? Is it is there blood in the wine? Warning, access to canals is partially restricted. Due to the publicly known situation in connection with the so-called devil's fevers, we inform that certain canals and underground passages are closed until further notice. You know, COVID never got like a cool like black plague or whatever name. But I think it's cool. Like maybe it's one of those things that historians will put on <laughs> an event after it happened but when you're in the middle you're like yeah maybe not anyone who attempts to forcibly open these accesses will be punished to the fullest extent of the law the remaining open canals are available for use provided that lockdown curfew hours are observed alrighty well thank you for this information I guess it's broken I don't need to inspect it Yeah, that was also to be expected. Do do do. I feel like I'm playing Dishonored. 
Empty bottle. Couldn't I just scrape off what's down here? I would do that. Also, this doesn't look empty. It's like someone walked around and just emptied out all the bottles. Weird, weird. This plays so smoothly and it looks so good. Warning, access to the- oh. Wait, there's one more thing. No, it's a different. Is it? Is it a different? Due to the notorious situation caused by the Devil's Fever use, all of Canada's destructible permitted passing through to reach resident request passage permit at any military headquarters. Okay. Reminder: free movement in any public place is strictly pro prohibited. Oh, I don't know what it is. I'm usually better at reading. Believe me. I aced the reading contest in my fourth grade. Like, I, I won that, you know. Everyone was so enthralled. Uh, during the first four days of the week. And it's limited to necessary activities related to health or work. Well, from experience, that won't last long, you know. After a while, that just let everyone do their thing. Jesus. Oh, God. Um, but... Can I crouch? No. Shit. What am I doing now? There's nothing... F f fudge. That's... Us. Oh, but at least he opened the door. Um, okay. Scared me shitless, though. Damn. So needless. Also, I feel... Oh, he didn't. So the weird... Str oh. That was... Oh, that's where he came... Oh, shit. Why do I have to run? All access routes to Pasaye de Ronda blocked. Use of Pasaye de Ronda for unnecessary travel is strictly prohibited, except for local residents until the cause of devil's fevers is known. All citizens must comply with these measures in this section of Pasaye de Ronda, except for members of the Honorable Bunny de Bosque family and workers employed in the estate and local authorities. Mm -hmm. So the elite is allowed to do what the folks cannot. Reminds me of something. You know, remember when the Kardashians had a big birthday bash? Like in the middle of the heaviest pandemic. I'm now so scared of the stranger. <laughs> I don't wanna, I mean this is a demo, so maybe, uh, left, uh, there we go. Oh. 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 Oh, but this is beautiful, this book. Oh. Mm hmm. Oh. I don't have time to read. Is this for running away? Can I die in this demo? I don't wanna. On this prologue, sorry. What's the difference between a demo and a prologue? The first cases of, oh, I know, in a minute. The first cases of widespread fevers have extended beyond the slums, reaching the other side of the river toward areas where wealthier citizens live. No, the rich people, that can't be. For the moment, there is no reason to pay much attention to these fevers. Although at this time of year, it is strange to have so many cases of flu, authorities are telling the public not to be alarmed. I mean, not every, I think, not every virus is dying in the heat, is it? In an unusual press conference with the Honorable Mr. Bandy de Bosque, the mayor gave his approval for wine production to continue. Even so, according to information this newspaper has obtained, if cases of fevers continue to rise at the current rate, the entire slums district, where the vast majority of immigrants live, will be closed off in confinement to stop further spread of the fevers. Immigration and diseases. Problems and solutions. 
Excuse me, what? What kind of right wing bullshit is that? Oh my holy fucking shit. That is disgusting. Man, eugenics are the, like the worst. Okay. Oh. I don't like the stranger. What is this? Ow. Okay. Oh. It's a giant key. It's look, this is this is how usually a can of soup how, how big it is. And the key was like this. This is the key. This is like this is gigantic. Who has a Okay, how does the lock look for a key like that? Oh, maybe it's for the door. Maybe um I couldn't even get through. I didn't even try it because it was oh so scared of the stranger. Key used. Yeah, that lock does not look like the key fit in there. Look how small that is. It's tiny. Excuse me, what? Why can't I do that? Oh! Gosh. Oh, okay. So I can... So I can run. I don't wanna run. I don't wanna. Oh yeah, I don't wanna. I'm not, I don't enjoy playing games where I'm unarmed. And get hunted down by someone with a gun. Oh, that's blood, is it? Yeah. Okay, you behave. You behave. I would be off this island. Like, the minute the stranger appeared, I would be off. Like, I'm not... I don't enjoy this. <laughs> yeah, I wanna look what's here, sorry. For... Oh, it's a little rat. Can you get up, little buddy? Huh. That's weird. Why can't I go in two directions? Oh, okay. So I probably have to do something here. So the... Oh, it's so cute. Oh my... Oh, no, I have stamina. Oh, shit. That's not good. I thought I can run forever. This looks really pretty. I mean, I usually play indie horror games that are... I don't even want to... I don't, don't even want to say less polished. They just have a different style. But it's always nice now and then to play, like... Ooh, you know, p with postcard motives. Well, a little bit... Messy because of the pandemic and everything, you know. But you know what I mean. I wonder whether the statue has something to do with the whole thing. But this is a prologue, so we'll probably not find out. I mean, okay, so the difference between a demo and a prologue. I, I asked myself this question, I, I think I can immediately answer it, is that a demo can be from any, any part in the game. I mean, it probably won't be like close to the end of the game, but it can be from the middle of the game. It can even be something that has nothing to do with the game, just to show how the game will look like, maybe get an insight into the story and the characters a little bit in gameplay. And a prologue obviously is the beginning of the game or it can even be a chapter that plays before the actual start of the game. Like I think um, Resident Evil 7 did it. So we have a wine bottle, but we also have a carafe. Is it called that? A vase. Oh, that's a lot of reading. 
to the Banny de Bosque family and their employees. As you well know, there's a strange fever ravaging the nearby areas. Oh, really? We didn't notice. <laughs> For your own safety, we urge you not to leave your property at any time until all this has passed. With this notice, we have no intention of accusing you of anything. It is well known that the fever originated in the poor neighborhood, where idle immigrants live in vomit-inducing conditions. Man, this race is bullshit. I give you my word as governor that when these fevers have passed and everything is cleared up, those vagrant illegals will receive their punishment. Excuse me? You know how important your winery is for the island's economy, so please excuse me for suggesting that you stay in your mansion cut off from contact with the outside world. But believe me, I recommend this for your own health and well-being. I'm calling it. It was the Benny the Boss. It was the freaking wine. They experimented with people, with poor people, and that's why those poor people got sick in the first place for the attention of the most honorable mr bunny de bosque i love this name i probably pronounce it incorrectly but my incorrect pronunciation is fun for me it has come to our attention that several of your employees have been infected with what some are calling the devil's fevers for your own safety we recommend that you isolate and dismiss these filthy and irresponsible persons and that under no circumstances you or the members of your family are to leave your mansion who knows what sort of low-class immigrants they have been spending their free time with. Probably a bunch of really cool people, okay? <laughs> Additionally, your granddaughter Leia has been noticeably absent from classes for some days now. We hope she is well, without wanting to cause offense. I remind you that if you or someone in your family is experiencing fever, you should inform the authorities for your own welfare. And... Attention to any member of the Banner de Bosque family. Due to uncontrolled infections related to the devil's fevers appearing among your employees, as governor I am forced to confine your entire family and temporarily put a stop to any winemaking activity until further notice. Effective immediately. But why didn't we hear at the beginning of the story that the wine helps? You have been assigned four military guards who will be your link to the outside world and take care of your purchases and other necessary errands. We hope that little Leia's health improves. Oh, so she... She in love with an immigrant boy. Or girl. Or non-binary person. You just... You just don't know. So... What's uh, with the red posters? Didn't I see more than one? Maybe I just saw this one. No, oh, up there. Well, I can't go up there, so... What's with the brooding background? That's so much to read. We are sad to hear the news that little Leia has passed. Oh, and the government sends our sincerest condolences. However, the fact that her death from the devil's fevers was kept secret from us for weeks was a despicable act on the part of your family. The tables are turning for the Bonitabosks. Therefore, you and your entire family will be forced into confinement indefinitely without any contact with the outside world until further notice. This breaks my heart, but the situation caused by the devil's fevers is spinning out of control. Because of your fine reputation and how dear you all are to everyone on the island, we will give you the privilege of stocking up on supplies one last time. Speak with the four young men we assigned to you about this matter. After this last job, you, they will no longer be helping you. Oh, just a little typo, that's okay, it's a demo. Prologue. Wasn't there a... Didn't I see another page? Oh, there, yeah. Notice to anyone found helping members of the Banner de Bosque family to flee. Any and all who are found helping members of the Banner de Bosque family or their employees will be placed in quarantine in a cell for five months. We urge all not to accept bribes from members of the family since they have all been infected with the devil's fevers and constitute a serious health danger. All tunnels and underground access to the winery, private cellars and the farmhouse have been sealed off and are monitored by the authorities. So is the gunman authority or is he a Benny de Bosque? Any family member by the last name Benny de Bosque found by the authorities outside the mansion will first have their belongings confiscated and burned, then be escorted back to the mansion. That's pretty polite, but it would be really annoying if you like have your your favorite I don't know plush toy <laughs> collectible with you. Okay, opens from the other side. So it will be probably a game with a lot of discovery. Huh. Huh. Where to go? Where to go? Usually the gunslinger turns it around when I'm stuck. 
Oh, I missed the right, maybe? No, I don't think there was anything. Hmm. Ah. Oops. Rewards for the killing of any bunny the boss. That escalated quickly. Bounty offered to any citizen who hunts down members of the bunny the boss family. The reward will be double for children. And triple if the dishonorable Mr. Bunny de Bosque is captured alive. They should preferably be killed with a weapon which does not cause them to bleed. But if a rifle is necessary, avoid shooting the head or arteries which may cause pools of blood to form. We remind you that leaving one's residence during quarantine, quarantine hours is still prohibited and everyone must take extreme precautions to combat the devil's fevers. We all know that the Bunny de Bosques did what, the, what they did. But that does not mean that the rest of us as citizens have a free us to ignore quarantine just to hunt them down. Jesus. Damn. Oh. Oh. Uh. To Jom and the other hired workers, your salaries will be reduced by one for the half next m two months. The Honorable, oh, he was still the Honorable there. Mr. Benny de Bosque has informed me of the following complaints regarding your poor building work on the structure and access to the private cellar. Sloppy construction of wooden structures for the tunnels and facades, stones for exterior opening placed in a very haphazard manner. <laughs> Just go with it. Flood damage in a storage chamber. Entrance door to staff housing fallen off hin of hinges. Extensive scratching on walls of areas where laborers are working. Supervisor J. Pujol. Damn. Yeah, that's really not good work. Okay, so... And now? Oh, okay. Ooh. 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 Can I go here? Okay. So I guess I will find a secret entrance here, work entrance, yeah. And uh, floop. Oh god, I'm back at amnesia. Yeah, it is very amnesia-like, by the way, so far. I hope you don't have to, like, have a weapon or anything. Man, yeah, that's really shoddy work. <laughs> Oh, that's blood. Shit. Okay, I can go down there. I think it is this ki kind of prologue. I think that would be really cool. Um, wait, what? What's that? Oh, uh, shit. Hmm. Maybe I can get to it some other way. Um, if it's not even part of the game... What is this? It's like magical. Um, but an actual prologue to the actual, to the, to the real game story. Okay, yeah that's wine and a uh, corkscrew. Before I go there, which looks so creepy. How can I? Can I get back up there then? Whoop. Or do I have to build? Oh. Oh, don't be so loud. You're scaring me. Oh, oh yeah, I have to wait. Whoop. Ooh. Oh, but I still can't. That's <laughs> can I? Huh? That is. Was I not supposed to go here? Oh, but this is good. This it really has a very strong amnesia feeling to it now. Oh shit. Okay. 
Oh god, don't you love awkward amnesia crate puzzles? Oh god, no, that was... Wait, wait. Oh. Well, look, look at this. How lucky. I was really lucky. Oh. Yeah, we'll look at that later. I want to go here first. Oh. Well. <laughs> well, that was nothing. Ow! Did I hurt myself? Important announcement from Foreman John Constanzo to all workers. <laughs> it's close to Const Costanza. Oh, no, it's really not. As if it were not difficult enough to work for the Banny de Basque family, now they've become paranoid because of everything with the fever and they've ordered us to install these strange metallic doors. They are simple to operate. To use these doors, push hard on the lever on the wall. The lever is stiff, so you will have to use some force. The door will shut automatically in a few hours. Okay, so that's okay. But what is this here? Oh, nothing. The usual. <laughs> Oh, that's so slow. That is so slow. Also, does that mean that I can get completely locked in here? Oh, I don't like that. Also, who put up the candles? That was the gunman. Did did he want like some nice atmospheric <laughs> candlelight? Just have it a little bit rom romantic. Play a little shoddy. <laughs> okay. Um, no, that's not what I wanted. Let's run and whoop. Okay, that was super cool. Damn. That was so cool. Oh shit. What 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 what? Okay. What is that? That's also like the weird bubbly letter. That's so weird. Huh. Can I jump down? Oh, oh, that looks very high. I will not try it. Oh, I have to try it. <laughs> when every single corner of this game is be like, oh, I first look there. This looks much more interesting. Oh, it's nothing. It's a dead end. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, that. Yeah. Like the like the noise, like the breaking stuff noise. That's a lot of wine. I can I can get all the wine here. Come on. Why am I not taking a bottle? Even if it's empty, I can hmm. That's weird. Okay, I need to... No! Oh, shit. Maybe a red one is one that doesn't break? Because, man... Who built these crates? They really can't take anything. Why am I still looking for a bottle? Everything's full with wine. I was just swimming in wine. Oh! First wanna look of course there's nothing here, but come on, just let me yeah. just let me do my idle weirdo thing. Ow Yeah. <laughs> Knickety knack. Oh that's too dark. Oh I did not see the third one, I think. And uh -huh. that doesn't make sense. Oh, okay. Oh no! Oh my god! Oh god! No! You know, I just played a game with two very dull jump scares. They got me, but they were not, I didn't enjoy them. But this one, whoo, the pacing of the scares, also with the 
But the shooter and everything, it's really good. Okay, so it's the vase and whatever that is. I'll look around a little bit. I think, yeah, we're still missing the third blue poster. And maybe it's... What? Oh! What the heck? Oh! Wow. They don't make any sense to me. And here's a way, so let's go this weirdo dream surreal pull up. <laughs> I regret this journey to get the wine. Oh no! Okay. Yeah, spin my little crate. You're free now! You're free! <laughs> Um, ah, oh, shit. Yeah, there we go. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> All right. Damn, this looks so cool. Also super confusing, but still cool. Bop. Come on. Oh, it's just, okay. Who? oh, shit. Um... Very well done. Exceptional. Look at this. I did not expect this. And it's kind of a really neat surprise. I like it. Yeah, this is a really pretty... Oh. So it's the... Uh. Shit, I don't have my notes. So, leaf and cork screw, and the glass, and the bottle, and I guess then it's the third poster that's directly next to the door. And I'm back here, this is so cool! But why can I s see that? And this doesn't mean, doesn't mean anything because I don't have the carafe. I don't know what the English name is for it. Okay, so... Oh, 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 okay. So the carafe and the weird organic thing. That's correct. That is... Plum, plum. And the glass and the bottle. There we go. That's neat. But else I will probably die now. Oh, this looks like... Oh, it's the door. Oh, Jesus Christ. That I nearly got killed by that headless person. That's a neat thing. Like, I thought I was dying. I thought that was the death. I was like, what could I have done here? But then that I was still alive. That was so cool. Yeah, this is uh, what I like about this game is it takes inspiration from Amnesia, but it's not identical to Amnesia. Both from the looks, I think it has its own distinct look. It's much brighter than Amnesia games. But also when it comes to playing, it feels different. Oh! 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 oh, oh. Anything he no, this is I think the prologue is not really for um Can I say spelunking? <laughs> it's not really for discovering a lot. Okay, so do I have to run? Oh look. I can use that as a weapon. Hmm. Oh shit. It's like hard work. That's not... I just wanted to have a cool bottle of wine. To have a fun night out with the girls. <laughs> watch watch a romantic comedy. And not think about life. 
And now I have to do this? Ugh. I will take more than one bottle. That's for- Oh no! Oh god, and I'm- uh, Like, I like the previous puzzles, and I'm also- I'm okay with, you know, more difficult puzzles, but awkward physical puzzles are really just weird when they are like this, where you first of all don't really know what to do, and second of all, where everything is so, well, not, you know, it doesn't fit in a way that you don't really know, like, I feel, am I always thinking something? Is there something I did not notice that is very easy to get? Is it maybe a hole in the wall? Oh, I can walk. Oh, no. No. Oh, shit. Oh, come on. Oh, I was overthinking it. Okay. <laughs> but still, I don't know if that was so successful as a puzzle. But that's just me. You can gladly tell me in the comments, by the way, if you feel like, no, I actually, I saw you play it and I immediately thought that's, <gasps> no, how you should go, then do that, please. I can't run. I can't run. Okay, now I can run. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh my god, I'm so out of shape. Oh god. Ow. Ow. What? Okay. <laughs> oh god. So much stress. Okay. Oh my god, I'm so out of- this is literally me. <laughs> but I don't get it. So, couldn't I run around very easily when I was doing the puzzle and suddenly I'm like out of shape after two seconds of running? Like, I should reset my priorities. Like, when I'm- when I'm being followed by a headless murderous ghost, I should have more stamina than when I'm doing just gentle puzzles. Okay, so what is this about? Oh, we're here now. Okay. Wow, that took us a little while. Man, I'm playing for quite a while though, as well. Sheesh. And someone put that thing back. Okay. Oh my god, Jesus Christ. So your family sent you to get the wine on this dangerous mission? Oh shit, what did I do? Oh, okay. Just knocked some cables off the table. They decided that you are the most capable of doing this? I don't know. Like, how unfit is your the rest of your family? <laughs> Uh, should I have somehow? No, how? <gasps> Will it now go back into the sea? Will it now go back into the sea? I say go back into the sea as if it came- that's where it came from, you know, back to its family of <laughs> carriage of stone carriages who were famously born in the sea. Oh no, okay. Hmm. So, I'm quite sure I'm supposed to kind of jump on there. Okay, so maybe I can... Oh, I get it. And then, oh god, can I manage to do... Oh god, okay. Because I'm so out of sh Like, okay, now, by now, I'm feeling like I am more in shape than this character, and I'm not. I'm really not. 
but this character is just incredibly out of shape. Wait, what? Oh yeah, I have to. Okay, I feel like I'm much higher than... No! <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Oh god. Okay, let's, let's try this again. I feel like I'm much higher on this than I'm... I actually should be. Okay, and now... Okay, don't mess it up. Oh boy. Plop. Okay. Oh no, a labyrinth. Oh no, I'm not a fan. I... Oh god. Is it time for the headless... The headless weirdo ghost? To be honest, I think two times is enough for a headless ghost to chase you. That's just my own thing, um, because I think good... S oh, I hear the music. <gasps> Is that the end of the prologue? Oh! End of the prologue. Oh, it's already out! <laughs> okay, good to know. Oh, it came out end of July 2021. Yeah, but I'm not going to. This will take too long. Um, yeah, this looks... I'm really... I'm putting this on my wish list and I'm considering really playing this because I think it, it looks gorgeous. It plays very smoothly. Some of the puzzles... I think the thing is with me, I'm, I'm an incredible overthinker. And sometimes the easiest solution is not in my head. Instead, I conjure up the weirdest things. Um, so we'll see about that. I'm also not quite sure how well I will do if I get actually chased by someone or have to hide. But if it's close to amnesia, I should be fine. Have a few deaths on my belt, but nothing too horrible. Um, so maybe I will do this, but I'm not, I'm not making any promises. So far, this will be basically the prologue, um, a demo first impression let's play. And, um, I will, I will see whether I will continue this or not. But yeah, um, fantastic developer Carlos Coronado. Um, I also, I really enjoy the setting. The island is a very good idea. Um, and... Also, the colors and everything. I mean, I'm not quite sure what the weird polar ice cap stuff is supposed to um, translate to in the real game, in the long game. But I'm looking forward to, to find a good explanation for it. And I hope it's a satisfying one. Also, very interesting. What I thought was really smart in the prologue that we had this... Rich family of uh, sommeliers, I guess. And, you know, at the, it started out the cliche. You have this rich island and they are the winemakers, so they're the honorable ones, etc. And then you have the plague and everyone's like, yeah, but the rich people, we have to sh save them because of the economy. And then how the tables turned. Because now it's very open, well, who actually caused the plague? Why were the villagers so against the, the rich family at some point? So it's getting more interesting. Um, it kind of reverts the, you know, the, the easy cliche of, oh yeah, they're, they're behind this. Because now I'm not so sure. Um, so yeah, beautiful, beautiful. And also, I appreciate this. I mean, I played this for an hour. This is probably, <laughs> as usual, it's... Usually when I play a game like this and it takes me an hour, it takes better Let's Play as half an hour. But I think I, I, got, I got through fairly well. I, I got stuck a little bit, but not, not in a way that I felt like, oh my god, I want to, I want to stop this. I don't know what to do anymore. So it kept me captivated. The solutions were easy enough to not get completely stuck. Yeah, fantastic. So I will add the link to the prologue as well as the Steam link, so you can also play this yourself in the liner notes. 
And um, if you have anything to say about this game, any cool stuff I missed or any references I missed, then feel free to comment on it. And also, um, if you like this video, you can like this video. And of course, first and foremost, you could subscribe to this channel. And I promise you, if there's a plague, if you're an immigrant or a rich person, well, if you're an immigrant or a poor, poor person, I will not blame the plague on you, okay? And I will not be like oh yeah the plague is the solution to the immigration problem like that is not me i would never do that not so sure about the rich people but probably also not <laughs> subscribe i guess <laughs> no i'm kidding um i mean you can subscribe that's not what i'm kidding about um yeah, have a wonderful day. I hope you had a good time. Have a wonderful day. And maybe see you soon. Bye bye bye. This is my self recorded outro song so I don't get hit with copyright claims. If you subscribe, you subscribe to a lot of fun tutorials, reviews, and let's plays.